Hi guys, so I just did a video on my daughter's 20 month update and I did talk for way too long so that means I have an even shorter amount of time for this video and I'm super sorry. Okay, so this is going to be my 17 week pregnancy update. Today is Tuesday so we are 17 weeks and 4 days pregnant today. And if you can't tell, I feel awesome, absolutely awesome. Um, week 15 and 16 were really, really hard, um, didn't feel good at all, it was a 50% toss up each day, um, whether it was going to be a good day or a bad day, um, my good days did make up for my bad days though, um, where if I did not feel good um, one day and I felt good the next day, on my good days I got a ton of stuff done, so it made up for my bad days. Um, and this video is late because I've been super busy. Um, we've had, like, we're taking down our summer decor, putting up fall decor. Um, I had garage sales last week. My husband is working on a bar, um, building it, finishing it, and all that stuff for a local bar of ours. Um, and we've had family in town, and it's just been crazy busy. So I'm so sorry this is late because I'm going to do another update in, like, three days ish if I'm on time. Um, but yes, I'm feeling so much better. But I'm going to quickly run down all this stuff and I know like I'm going to talk fast, but I have even less time now. Okay, so I have a, I'm noticing that I'm having a shorter temper. Um, I don't have a whole lot of patience um, for a lot of things lately. Um, so I'm finding that I'm like jumping on stuff where I used to be calm and relaxed and stuff, but my temper is getting shorter. Um, I have a lot of stretching and discomfort in my abdomen, and I've had lots of back pain um, the last three weeks. So that is getting um, bad. <laughs> if it gets worse, I'm going to go to the chiropractor and get that fixed. Because um, it's get to, gotten to the point where I need to do something about it if it is going to continue. Um, my appetite has increased so much. It feels like I want to eat all day long, which I was before because I couldn't eat bigger meals because it would make me sick. Now, I just can't stop eating. So I'm going to be interested to find out how much weight that I gain in my appointment next week. Um, a little scared about that, but... I, I feel great. I'm active. I'm not sitting on the couch, not doing anything. Um, getting out there, getting stuff done, getting my stuff done. I feel fabulous. So, whatever. It's all good. Um, I'm having cravings for super unhealthy things. Like, super unhealthy things. Like, no nutritional value whatsoever things. Um, it's... Ugh. I just, the things that I want are, and it's every day, and it's all day long. It's, ooh, I could go to McDonald's for breakfast, or, ooh, how about Chinese, or, ooh, how about this, or how about this, and it's, like, all really bad stuff. Um, so I am trying to stay up on the veggies, eating spinach, and all that kind of stuff, um, having salads pretty much every day, just to get the dark leafy green stuff. Um, been trying to eat a lot of carrots when I'm hungry. Um, been trying to be as healthy as possible, but it is hard when everything I want to eat is bad for me. Um, we have given in to my cravings like twice this week, so whoops. But oh well, it'll all be fine and make up for itself, and that's what I want, so that must be what the baby wants. That's how I think of it. Um, I have been sleeping way better, um, but I've been having weird dreams, like, and it's the good decision, bad decision dreams. So it's either, like, all my dreams, like, the last week and a half have been, I have a decision to make, and either I do this or I do this, but which one's the best one? And then, like, the scenario will play out whichever decision I make, and, like, it's... Like, that kind of stuff, like, freaks me out because, like, I'm just like, well, why didn't I choose this? Or why did I do this? Or I should have done that. And then I'm like, it was my dream. Like, it just seems crazy. Um, I'm working on my baby buys list. I have my final list um, done, but I'm going to sit on it for another month yet before I actually start buying stuff. Um, because I'm the type of person where I'm just like, oh, well, I need this. And then I figure out some other way to do it or something, research stuff and all that stuff. Um, in five months, we're going to have a baby. <laughs> oh, like that just like, 
seems crazy, from Saturday, this Saturday, which I'll probably say that again in my next week's video, but we're going to have a baby in five months. Um, there was a baby on TV just the other day, and my daughter was like, baby, 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 and I was like, we're going to have one of those in a little bit, and then I was like, I can't believe I just said that. Like, it just, it's been real this whole time, but, like, that just kind of made it even more real, like, saying it out loud, like, to my daughter. Like, we're going to have one of those in a little bit. So, I don't know. Like, it's just, it's just crazy. Um, I have an ultrasound next week, and I also have my appointment next week, which I will talk about in my next week's video. Um... But I want to do a belly shot really quick because I haven't done a belly shot in a long time. Um, ooh, if you <laughs> want to know what my belly looks like at the end of the day, I've said it in a ton of videos that my bloat belly by the end of the day is huge. Looks like I'm six months pregnant, like gigantic. I actually finally <laughs> was awake enough, <laughs> just enough, because I look like complete crap in that video, but I was awake just enough to film my belly on, let's see, last Friday night, and it is like huge, like crazy huge. So I'm going to do a belly shot really quick, and then we will be done, because I am all out of time. But anyways, okay, so we will do, hopefully, we'll go down a little bit. There we go. Okay, so I am wearing a sports bra today. They've been more comfortable lately, so I've been sticking with sports bras, or my nursing bras. Um, that I will still do a review on sometime. Okay, so boobs go here. They're a little bit low because they're in a sports bra. Um, so anyways, back and then this is belly. So baby is still, I find the heartbeat about right here. It's a little bit up on my little muffin top I got um, where I used to find it all the way down here. If you can see where my hands are, it's moving up where I'm finding it just at the bottom of my muffin. And I know that sounds bad, but that's where I'm finding it at. So there is, and I am sticking out a little bit farther than I was before, but this is no comparison at all. Watch my, I don't remember what I named it, but it's like something like end of day baby bloat belly or something like that. Like my stomach is out to here at night. So this is after lunch. And so I have eaten breakfast, and I snacked, and I've eaten lunch. So this is what it looks like after that. The mornings, usually, um, you could, I just have this right here, this little muffin right here in the morning. But this is after eating all day. So there a little tiger is down in here. So exciting. So very, very exciting. Hopefully you saw that. I know that, like, the camera angle sometimes makes it look funny and I wear black all the time so that doesn't help either um but yeah like <laughs> I'm just my pregnancy goal from here on out since um we're like it's like so just absolutely awesome that we only have five months left from Saturday crazy um but basically what I'm gonna try to do for the rest of this pregnancy and also to keep time going by as fast as it has because if the second half of the pregnancy goes by as fast as this first half did, I just, it's going to be here in a blink of an eye, in a blink, especially with all the stuff that we have going on. Um, crazy, crazy, crazy how fast it's going to go. But I just want to start, like, I'm, I've revamped my to-do list and things that I really would like to get done. And it is a very detailed list. And then I'm going to try to get as much of that stuff done. But if it doesn't happen or whatever, it's fine. Um, I just, since I've been so productive in everything this whole pregnancy, like besides, like August really set it off for me, I guess. So I guess just the last two months, <laughs> I've been so productive. I have really high hopes for the rest of the five months that we have left. Um, so I've revamped my to-do list and... Um, just, I'm very hopeful for like projects to get done and my to-do lists to get done. Um, I'm just like, I need to pace myself and not try to get everything done right away and everything. But there's time, like there's five months left and like I don't have like a super huge list to do or anything like that. But um, 
I'm just like getting things organized like I have to go supply shopping in November and we have baby buys and like set up and prep and all that kind of stuff to do um, so I'm just gonna split everything up over the next five months ish <laughs> probably four months and then take the last month off to just cool it would probably be like the best case scenario but anyways so that is my 17 week update and again I'm sorry it's late but you all have a fabulous day and I have to go because I'm out of time <laughs> talk to you later bye